It is an extremely hot day in Florida right now. I don't have my paint on. I just came from a water park with Primrose, so hey. We still outside doing the same thing though. We're at Lula Mays Eatery. I'm here to meet the owner, Candace. Let's go in and say hello. You're Candace? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Hey. I do the hugs. How you doing? Thanks for inviting me out. Yeah. So how long you been here? Since September 15th. September 15th? Yeah. Dope. Mm -hmm. What kind of food y'all sell? Yeah, uh, so we do everyday American food. Okay. Oh, where the menus at? I'm gonna take a look at them. As you can see, here's the menu. A wide variety of soul food options, uh, drinks. It's an amazing thing. And here's uh, decorations. It's very homey. It's like you're in somebody's living room or somebody's actual like home. So I wound up ordering the grilled cheese sandwich because I had already eaten at another place before I showed up at Lula Maze. So I didn't want to be super, super stuffed. So I tried one of their smaller items. Can't go wrong with a classic grilled cheese. First bite. I ain't gonna lie, the texture of that bread was perfect. That cheese was hidden. Oh man. Then the lemonade. Let me tell y'all something about that lemonade. That ain't no regular lemonade, okay? Yeah, that's that homemade. That's, yeah. Huh. And you see that face? That's the look of complete satisfaction. Alright, so I gotta ask, who is Lula May? That's how, am I, am I saying it right? Lula May, so clearly that's... An, oh, okay, nice. <laughs> So this is her business, her idea? Yeah. Well, no. My dad passed away and decided to open the business. Mm -hmm. And he wanted to name after my mom. Nah. The idea of my dad. But my dad was saying, nope, name it after me, name it after me. Okay. So this is a picture of Candace which is the owner of Lula Mays. That's who I'm sitting and talking to. She's on the left and that's her dad on the right. And I just love the story of honoring you know, loved ones who've passed away and honoring them the right way. And that's Lula Mae, that's her mom on the right. About how long after he passed away did you get the idea to start the place? A couple of months. I like the energy behind that. A lot of people dream of having their own business and to be entrepreneurs. We all want to live a life that we are proud of and that means something to us. And it usually comes through things happening in your life you get inspired to do something positive right. of course had to catch a wave with the ladies at lula may's eatery uh candace the owner and then the two ladies on the right that's actually a mother and a daughter this is beautiful this is generational support and love in this business and i just believe when the energy is right when you put the right people together and the right energy into a business or an idea it's going to work and I know that the energy behind this business is pure. I got a little bit of the story from Candace. She's put a lot of money into this business. She's invested her time, energy, and funds into making this business work. And I wanna make sure we get some people down there. Not some people, but a lot of people. I wanna see more local support for these businesses in North Apopka and South Apopka. This, this business is located in South Apopka and I really wanna put more light in, on this area. And I wanna make sure all the wealth is spread around this town and that's the vision. So thank you again to Lula Mays. Uh, I will be back and if you're in the area, definitely stop by. My name is Alexander Ayota and you can join the wave movement by becoming an official patron on my Patreon. Every day the goal is to spread love and to use social media as a platform to spark more human connection. This is the energy that will improve communities and eventually change the world.